Okay. All right. Thank you guys for getting on here. I so appreciate it, especially on a Sunday. Um, but I feel like this speaks volumes to you guys as to what this team is doing. So first of all, um, I want to let you guys know that you are one of the fastest growing teams in Team PCS right now. Yeah, <laughs> it is so awesome. I mean, it is amazing how you guys are popping out qualifiers. Like, um, I truly believe that Ashley is going to be a six club this month, if not higher. Um, Jamie, with you fast tracking to VF, I'm just going to, you know, put a little pressure on you because I know you can handle it. Is I think you may, might, you may be that six um, to make sure you're in qualifiers. What's that? He's already over halfway there. Ah, too easy. No. Too easy. <laughs> and then you just want to, you want to duplicate that. Um, it's, it's amazing the, the system that you guys have going on. But first, um, because you guys are scattered all around the world, as our entire team is, I just wanted to get a, a quick like intro to who everyone is, especially since you guys have some new team coming in. So if you guys can just say like, um, you know, where you're at, where you live, um, what, you know, maybe some wins in the business real quick, what you feel like is worth celebrating, then let's do that. And then I'll move on to the rest of the stuff. But I, I really want to make sure you guys know who each other are. It's very important that we know everybody. So yeah, go ahead, Jamie, start it off. Hey, everybody. I'm Jamie. I'm, um, I've been here for two weeks. I'm super excited. My husband and I have like big dreams for Juice Plus and we're in Sanford, North Carolina. Awesome. Thank you, Jamie. And she just fast tracked to VF in two weeks, um, which means Ashley is really good at fast tracking VFs in two weeks too. You guys have like, I mean, Ashley's the best at it on the team. So do what she tells you to do. Clearly it's working, but she's also very good at bringing in awesome team members. Who's next? So, okay. It's yep. Audie. Um, I I feel like I have no sense of time span, so I think it's been. I think I'm in my second week, but um, I'm not sure. <laughs> I think it's my second week, and um, I've just been enjoying, you know, learning from everybody and being a part of the team. Awesome. And and Audie and Jamie are our best friends. They're BFFs. Just we're besties. <laughs> yes. It's awesome bringing your best friend into this. Who else? <laughs> You're next. <laughs> Me? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so I'm Amber, even though my name says Lee. I had it set up for my mom yesterday for the, the call we did freedom revolution and then I ended up still using my own phone. Um, so I'll switch that back, but I'm Amber. I'm in Tucson, Arizona and, um, Ashley recruited me a while ago and I'm just really slacking. So I already told Ashley, I'm going to set up a bunch of calls with her coaching calls cause I need to get this moving. I finally made my first sale last week. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> So I was super excited about that. And it's somebody I'm super happy about it because I love her dearly. She's been one of my best friends since I was like, I don't know, born. So, um, yeah, so that's kind of who I am. <laughs> Thank you, Amber. Good seeing you on here. All right, Katrina, I'm calling you up next because I can tell you just in thought. <laughs> okay. Um, my name's Katrina and I'm from Montana. Um, uh, what Christy was saying, Ashley's amazing at getting you fast track to VF. She did me as well. <laughs> um, and I guess I've known Chris or I've known Ashley s just through Jeremy and from Juice Plus. <laughs> I was in the military with Jeremy, but other than that, we're all kind of doing it via the Zoom and Boxer. <laughs> yes, Katrina was accidentally added to our team page. <laughs> so it works, apparently. Yep. Katrina and Ashley are the same person, basically. All right, Bridget. Hey, everyone. My name is Bridget, and I'm here in Hope Mills, North Carolina. I know Ashley yeah, yeah. through, yeah, yeah. well, I went and signed 
co-founder of Amy, which is a co-worker of Rick's, and Jeremy is also a co-worker of Rick's, and then, so I met Ashley through the upline. <laughs> and I'm always busy with children. And she just qualified her business despite being so busy with children and animals and everything else. So she's a rock star, as all of you guys are. So I just want to point out um, how Ashley barely knew any of you except for Amber in this business. Okay. And so even though you can have like a warm market, it's amazing who you come across in life. Like Jamie, who happened to have like a vegan event at her house, you know? So, um, of course Ashley went, you know, so, so just know, be, be open to knowing that there are so many people out there that are untouched. So just be aware of, of where you're at and where you're going. So speaking of where you're going, you guys as a team are going to national marketing director, which is huge. So ah, freaking Ashley skates, um, strongest sales coordinator on the team. And she is, we got to hit SSC this month. Like we got to hit SSC. So you guys can see what it's like to hit SSC, Q and MD and NMD in like literally the next three or four months. What's today? June, June, July, August, September, four months. You guys are going to see wicked fast growth. Um, and we're going to love you where you're at. But if you want to be on this train to being a huge part of helping Ashley. Yeah. <laughs> right. Jamie. Um, we definitely need you. Um, we, we need you to play ball with us, play big, play ball. You guys are doing a great job booking her, um, booking me, whoever, like, Jeremy is gone. Do not feel like you are interrupting her. Do not the what you're not doing is you're not utilizing her. Make this girl not sleep if possible. She needs all the distractions she possibly can have and she thrives to help her team. So let her help you. Don't feel like any question is too dumb that you're asking too much of her. She's going to tell you. She can be very transparent with you. Um, but what it looks like to get to national marketing director is a lot of growth and getting out of your comfort zone and not being attached to the outcome. And that's for all of you guys, because we're raising up you guys to take on the, the position as soon as she hits. So um, I want to talk a little bit about as far as what do you guys need? What do you want to accomplish over the summer? But I'm also going to put it out there. I know that um, Katrina's on here and I know Kimber's not right now, but first I want to tell you guys a lot of times spouses in the business do not get counted as a leg. Now we're working on making corporate understand that Jeremy is actually working his leg and he's not sleeping his way to the top, as we would say it. Um, so we want them to know that, but there's still a chance that they may not count him as actually one of her sales coordinators. To get to national marketing director, you need five sales coordinators. Um, and Jeremy may not be counted up as leg, and he is her only sales coordinator right now. So, so Katrina and Kimber, we have a little bit of pressure on these girls, and I know they can get to sales coordinator. I absolutely know it. So um, think them strong because they're going to be backing up Ashley and Jeremy. But we also are looking for other SEs who are direct to Ashley. So, and I know a lot of you guys have some big goals. So Jamie, I know, I know you're working towards getting an SC. Um, especially with Audi, you guys are like just the best dynamic duo. So duplicating that. And I know, I, I mean, I know Bridget, she's, she's got a date for her NMD date. So <laughs> she's in too. So I want to talk about playing big today. So, um, do you all know what you really need to hit to sales coordinator or beyond? Okay. So let me paint a picture first like this, and we're going to get to you guys individually, but most of you guys know, let me start with this. Do you know what is needed to get to fast track to VF? Yeah. <laughs> Bridget, I just looked over at your daughter and she was shaking her head. I was like, Oh, you don't know what is to fast track to VF. Let me tell you. So let me just, let me just repeat it just in case, because I know we're recording this for people. Um, fast track to VF is eight different households. So when we say eight households, we need to make sure that the credit card and the shipping is associated with eight separate households, right? So if you buy for your mom with your credit card, but yet you ship it to her, that's going to be still your household. It's not going to be a new one, okay? So we want to be cautious of that. Um, to make it easy, we need 2,000 points, but let's just say if you get eight shred orders from eight separate households, you're probably at 4,000 points, not 2,000 points, and that is really a good thing for you. And you need at least one team member with at least one order, but we're playing big here, so I'm gonna encourage you to go with three, okay? Because you're not always gonna get a runner right away, and we need runners, um, and you want runners because it helps you become a better leader. 
these runners just put you into a completely different like form of, of learning faster. They're a blessing. So bringing on team members allows you as a team member to grow faster. So, so to get to VF, 2000 or 2000 points, eight households, at least one team member. Okay. Let's just say eight shred orders, three team members. You're going to be clear. Um, or six and three, what we've been teaching you guys, because your volume and your person who's direct to you, their volume is all going to count towards the, the points that you need. So how to get to the sales coordinator, three VFs. You bring in three VFs direct to you and you are going to get to sales coordinator. Okay. So that's three, six, $900 in bonuses. And then another $600 bonus for fast track to SC. So there's a really good incentive there too. And then to get to national marketing director, you need five NMD or five SCs. Any question on that? And of course, we're going to be focusing individually on you guys within coaching calls and, and all that. But any questions as far as big picture goes? Okay. So looking at everything. Um, so I know, um, Amber, I'm going to start with you. Where'd you go? Um, so we're focusing on getting you to fast track to VF, right? Yes. Yes. Can you hear me? <laughs> yep. I can hear you. Okay. And then your planning, your plan of attack is to do lots of consult calls, actually, right? Yes. Yeah. I um, set up all kinds of calls is my plan. <laughs> okay. Awesome. That's, that's going to be it. I can tell you guys when I was going for it, I was doing probably five consult calls a day, if not like big Zoom events. So um, I think Ashley needs more than that, to be quite honest, because they've changed the rules with NMD a little bit. So if you can't get her, get me. If you can't get me, we're going to find someone. So don't wait for us. We'll find someone else on the team to do a consult call for you. Um, there's going to be plenty of you guys to be able to do it. Um, I am anticipating seeing Jamie lead some here pretty soon, too. Um, you know, and actually really the rest of you, but I know she has really kind of voiced some of that. So, um, so it's not just going to be some of the leadership. It's going to be you guys stepping into leadership and just killing it. It's going to be awesome. Um, so Amber, we've got you tracking for, for VF, um, Katrina, we know that you are going to be qualified for the month of June already. So we're going to keep working towards the 1600 in volume. And if that doesn't make sense to you, it's, we're going to work on that with individual calls, but really, you know, to be customer qualified at a thousand points is great. Um, but people cancel their orders. They delay their orders. So we don't want you to fall out of qualification because if you do, you're leaving money on the table. So we like to put you onto like the little safety net and get you into the 1600 range, which is about 15 shred orders or about 40 trio capsule orders. I haven't figured out quad orders yet. I need to do that. Um, but that's going to give you as a sales coordinator position, you're going to make about $750 a month just on your own customers. That doesn't mean what your team is duplicating down with you. Okay. But to give you that buffer. So Katrina working towards the 1600 in volume and then working to get you to SC. And I know you can do it. No doubt in my mind. Um, Bridget just qualified her business. So we are now working again to the 1600. So you and Katrina could essentially be running buddies in this. Also getting you to SC. Um, and then, I mean, Adi, you are so like, I think you are, we're going to have VF in the bag for you. So I think what we got to do, if we haven't already, is get you filling in your tracker um, to looking at what you need to qualify your business. Cause I, I see that as the next step. Um, um, same thing with Jamie, qualify, qualify your business and, um, and focus on SC too. So really it's a lot of team building. So if you can, if you guys feel comfortable leading with the business first as an opportunity for people, if you want to work with them <laughs> and then they of course need to know what it is that you're doing. So obviously you want to in, you know, invite them to learn about what Juice Plus is, but it helps to lead first with the business as an opportunity and then um, always go back. Yeah, Jamie, go ahead. So I'm just trying to like pick everybody's brain. Like if you were to bring up a conversation, like what would that look like if you were trying to get somebody to, to lead with the business? What would you say? I always like to know who you're talking to. So do you have someone in your head? Yes. My friend Lauren, she's like ultra crunchy mom and is going to school for holistic nutrition. Well, what would you say to her? I love her. <laughs> I would say, girlfriend, I am looking at seriously creating an incredible life for myself and I'm taking as many badass chicks as I want with me and you're at the top of the list. 
you have the opportunity with your background and your passion to change a lot of lives with this. And I'm just asking you to be open to what it is that I'm doing. Okay. All Something right. Like Com okay. Always compliment them because for a really per good reason why you love them. You know, I okay. think we don't love enough people. Like we aren't outwardly complimentary enough. And this always gives that opportunity. And, and I can even from like a cold market perspective, like if there is a girl who is a waitress and she's just doing a great job, um, I'm having a, like a good conversation with her. I just, you know, ask like, Hey, is this, is this your end all be all? Do you plan on be on serving for the rest of your life? And they're of course going to say no. So I just say like, look, you have great customer service skills. I'm looking for somebody that has that skill already. We also have really great energy. Are you open to a second opportunity, you know, a second income or another side hustle? And most of the time they say yes. And I say, and I, you know, I don't know if it's going to be for you or not, but I'd love to be on, you know, just get on a call with you. And Hey, if nothing else, take it as a compliment. I think you, what you do is incredible. You should get paid more for what you do. And again, like not being attached to the outcome, but just like the reality is, is you're doing an awesome job, you know, take it as a compliment. So it's all practice, especially with the cold mark. Yeah, no, I love that. Thank you for that. Yeah, absolutely. Any, any other questions? I have a question. Uh-huh. Um, Audie here. <laughs> um, I'm actually writing back and forth with um, somebody who's going to be making a purchase this evening and... Um, she was asking about the four month supply after the four month passes, does it continue or does she have to reorder based on maybe if she wants to make some changes? That's a great question. So I always try to find the most positive way to respond to any question that they have, because some people may have like, well, I don't like auto installments or whatever. I say, yes, absolutely. The company keeps you on a four month like shipment a schedule, but you as the customer have the power of looking at your own product, like your own shipment, and you can decide if you want to expedite it because you've been going through it faster than you expected. You can delay if you've forgotten to take your juice plus, but you'd never want to forget to take your juice plus. Um, but you can also change your orders or I'm also going to be keeping my eyes on your orders too. And I'm going to let you know at least 10 days, if not 30 days in advance when your order is scheduled to ship and we'll have plenty of time to make those changes. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Uh huh. What else? Ashley, do you have anything that you want to specifically go over? Otherwise, I have some other ideas. Well, I think that, and I don't know if you think this is a good idea, but I would like to show them my organizational chart and explain where I'm at on my way mm -hmm. to sales and like what my I'm like this, I could have had it in May, but I'm missing a very key piece oh. called working legs. Okay. So I want them to be able to see it. So when they are at this point in their push to NMD, they know what to look for. So what do you think about showing them? That. Absolutely. I think visually to be able to imagine what a strong sales coordinator leg looks like from an organizational chart. Absolutely. Okay. I'm just getting signed in. Okay. I should be very proud of this organizational chart. You're a huge part of it. <laughs> and you guys know, like, Go ahead. No, I was gonna say you might want to talk about something. This is taking me for a okay. You know you can you can seriously build a business fast if you really, really want to. It really, really can happen. Um, and obviously Ashley is about to, to show you how only with you, you know. Um, so it you could be right after her, really. Is there any way you can zoom out a little bit? Your organizational chart is so big. <laughs> Working on it. <laughs> That's a great problem to have, you guys. All right, that's it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so do you wanna go through it or do you want me to? I can go through it. So okay. my goal for senior sales coordinator, I should have had it this last month and 
the only thing that's standing between me and that is basically three working legs. Um, and what was it, Christy? Like 40 PV I'm off of? Yeah, your PV, you're almost like you're almost there, but we do have to have, we, we've got to have two VF, the VFs with six working legs. Right. Yeah. So, well, I need, yes. So I have, my sales coordinator leg has six, you need six to eight working legs because you don't want to just do senior sales coordinator. You want to be focusing on what you're going to need for Q and Q is going to be eight working legs. So Jeremy's my sales coordinator and he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven working legs that have over 90 PV in it. And what that is, that's like a distributor that has at least three payment or three installment payment orders under them. Otherwise they don't count as structure. So that's good. And then I need a 2000 plus VF with six working legs. And I have that, I have my 2000 plus VF here is Amy and Bridget, but I only have three legs under Amy and um, one under Bridget. So I'm short three legs there. And then I have another one. I have multiple VFs, but, um, and with like my Jamie leg, she has one under her. So the only thing that's stopping me from hitting senior sales coordinator is just adding team. Um, I've grown wide, which is great for NMD because I'm going to need five sales coordinators. Um, I just need to focus on building deeper lines now. Mm-hmm. Yes. So basically, um, Bridges team and Jamie's team, you guys are the ones I think that have the most potential to impact the, the working lines that Ashley is talking about. Um, and, and really like you heard her say, it's, it's a team member with three customers on installment. You know, it's literally three duo orders, three to four duo orders on installment. And our team doesn't lead with duo orders. So, um, so it's a very easy thing to do. However, it's a detail that gets overlooked and keeps someone from getting promoted to it. So Ashley, how many team members did you bring in to your business this past month on your own? Three. Three. Okay. So, and how many do you think are working legs so far? Month one for them? The three that I brought in, um, two of them are. Two of the three. So that's a pretty good track record. Yeah. So can you talk to them a little bit about what your, um, what you did to build three, three team members this month? Two working legs? Well, mainly I can, I always lead with the business and, and just like when you read the get over your dance damn self, or you attend the training that we have in our files tab on uh, team PCS, it talks about it. Like I, I look for people who are not happy in their jobs and mainly because that's how I was. Like I was giving all my free time, all of my energy to something that just no longer filled my cup. And it was very hard to take time away from my family to be able to, to do that and be miserable doing it. So I look for people that are in similar situations to me that want to earn extra income or do more with their families or just live better than they're living now. And I share on, you know, what this business has done for me. And, you know, if, if it's not something that they're interested in, that's perfectly fine. Our product is for everybody and you can easily go from, okay, so this business doesn't work, but are you eating the seven to 13 servings of fruits and vegetables a day? The majority of us are not. So then you can easily segue into the, the products. But if you lead with the products and they, it, they can't wrap their mind around bridging the gap of what they're supposed to eat and what they do eat every day, then you're not going to want to be like, well, since you completely don't understand the concept of our fruits, vegetables, and berries in a capsule, then maybe you should do this business. It just, that's a very awkward transition and I don't think it would be very successful. So it's so much easier talking to people about the business first. Yeah. And when you talk about the business first, it gets those entrepreneurial gears turning. And while some people don't have those gears right away, they do start thinking about who do they know? You almost don't even have to ask. They just start thinking about it. Um, so that helps. So 
Before I have asked Ashley to do one more thing, do you guys have any questions about the organizational chart that she showed you? Katrina? I do. Okay, so, um, and Christy, I'm not sure if you're, I think it's, it's, in my, it's in the Upline Voxer chat, but I know that Ashley's aware of it. Lacey, um, who was going to sign up under Pam, messaged me, and she has two people interested in putting an order in. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So she'll be signing up under Pam, who just fast-tracked to DD in May. Um, is that going to be, like, I mean, is that going to be helpful to Ashley at all? Because she said she's got two people who want to put orders in. So is that like? Yes. Yep. Because you're going to need volume big time. I mean, structurally, you guys, as long as corporate sees Jeremy as a sales coordinator, legit sales coordinator, um, your, your line is great. What you're doing is helping towards volume needed. Um, and then especially not just now going for QNMD and NMD but also another building closer to helping you become a sales coordinator. Every single order counts, every movement with a team member counts. Right, okay. Yep. And it's gonna help Pam get promoted to VF because you're gonna need her to be one of your 2000 plus VFs for sales coordinator. Mm -hmm. Right, for sure. And I'm not sure if that's gonna be, um, you and me had talked before about like loving them where they're at. <laughs> um, I don't think that it's like a fast track thing with Pam. I think that slow and steady is going to win the race, but um, she definitely is passionate about the product and wants to share and wants to help others. So that being the forefront, you know what I mean? Like yeah, well, she already has the three households plus Lacey would have been four, right? Was Lacey four or three? Um, she has Kenzie and Tony and then herself under her. And then, so and then Lacey as well. So that's six people. She would only need two more households to fast track in a 60 day period. So. To VF. Okay. Yeah. Wait, Lacey could do the rest and get rid of VF as well, you know, in the process. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Any other questions? Yes. Yeah, so if I add two new uh individuals under my organization how does that help you ashley in regards to working legs because that because i have one short on your line yeah okay so i would need somebody to sign up under them to be and fast track them to be vf to be able to be where jeremy's at just three they would just need to get to dd so they would have that 90 pv going through their business three or okay but then we're Bridget getting to SC. Yeah. Yeah. If you, Bridget, if you focus on getting to SC this month, because it can happen, all those working legs are just going to fall into place. Because yeah. that's what I'm working on right now. I'm putting feelers out there. So. Awesome. But yeah, you, your, your line um, is three, yeah, three people short from the working legs needed for a VF leg. Yeah, but you got, you've got NMD on your, in your sites. So we're gonna say three, three VFs for you this month. Get you to SC. Yeah. Anybody else? Okay, so Ashley, I was just hoping that maybe you could shed some light on what this journey has been like for you and what um, kind of how you imagine this summer going, um, just kind of painting a picture for everyone who's never been a part, I and mean, no one has ever been a part of promoting an NMD except for you. So what do you envision and what do you see this doing for you? Well, um, more than anything, I need your guys' help just being distracted in a positive way. Um, this is obviously not our family's ideal such situation to be separated in different countries, not really knowing. And I'm sorry, I know the internet keeps going out. So um, not really knowing like when that's going to be resolved. So please don't be afraid to schedule a call. Use and abuse me. I say that all the time on Voxer, just use and abuse me because it makes my time go by so much faster. And the faster my time goes, the sooner I'll be with my family. So um, 
when I joined this business, Christy was on her way to national marketing director and I wanted to be a part of that momentum. I didn't really see at that point in time, like this business as I didn't take it serious, but I took her goal serious because she was serious about it. And it took me a lot longer to kind of really see where this would fit in my life. And that was, you know, I thought I was going to get through one meeting without crying, <laughs> but apparently not. So <laughs> I literally had to have everything taken away from me. Like, and it was ridiculous. You know, I was told I couldn't go say goodbye to my grandmother. I was told I couldn't be there for Elias's first day of kindergarten. I couldn't be at his veterans day parade. Like I was being just told all these things. I, and I, it's not like I'm a private anymore. I'm a senior NCO at 18 years given to this organization. And I'm still being told like more of, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I'm, I'm done with it, obviously. So um, for me, it's like this summer, if I can paint like a visualization for you, like if you remember back when you were getting out of school and um, it was like that last day of school and the bell rang and everybody's moving towards these double doors and the doors fly open and it's like this beautiful summer day and you're about to be free and there's like papers flying in the air and like you're going out that door and you have the whole summer ahead of you and you can just make it into anything that you want to make it into. That's where I feel like I'm at right now. So I couldn't be more excited to spend the summer helping you guys build your businesses and, you know, and avoid making some of the, um, avoid making this as hard as I have made it for myself. <laughs> uh, I definitely did not take the direct path to building this business. I, I took a lot of wrong turns along the way. And, and I know that, you know, like Audie's vision for her, how come of doing this business just gives me goosebumps every time I think about it. You know, she wants her husband to be able to pursue his passion. And Jamie wants her husband to be home and with the family more. And like, I get that stuff. And, you know, Bridget, I don't think there's anything in this world that this girl's not going to be able to accomplish because I'm amazed at everything that she gets done with everything she has going on. So, and Amber's my like, tough cookie to crack. Um, this business is going to be so amazing for her. And I can't wait for Katrina, who is about to have a baby any day now. And I never knew her. And most of you never knew any of you before this, but like your goals are what drives me. And I know that I need to show you how to get to NMD. And then so I can turn around on that stage and reach my hand down and bring each one of you up with me because I'm not going to stand up, stand up there by myself. Like I see this for all of you and I'm just so excited. And so we have, you know, June and July for sure to just do everything that we could possibly do to propel ourselves forward. And that momentum will take us to the top. We just have to stay out of its way. So. Any questions for Ashley? We need to move into my house so we can like do this together. <laughs> <laughs> I think it is so awesome that she gets to move in with you. The 18th. <laughs> you guys want to be a part of this? I think you guys are the crew to do this. This is a powerful group of women and one man. <laughs> But this, this is going to be incredible. Now, we, we've got to get the structure in by August and September. So everybody who's going for SC, we need you at the end of July to, to be a big part of the five sales coordinator group is end of July sales coordinator. Now, I know people who made it to sales coordinator in six weeks. Okay. So this can be done. It can absolutely be done. If you, if you lead with the six, three and teach everyone to do it, you can be sales coordinator in a month. Um, you know, but we can make sure it happens, but this is like all out 
massive action, trial by fire, and just loving people where they're at during this entire journey. But volume wise, July is where we need to begin to have a lot of volume. Um, basically double what you guys did this past month is, no, that's Q volume, isn't it? I'm bad at math, Ashley. We need to have 33,000 in volume, which I know none of you guys really, Ashley may know, be the one that gets it, but we need a lot of volume. Um, starting in July, August, and September, we basically have to have 33 and some change each month. Quadruple it. Quadruple it. 33,000 or 3,000? 33,000 each month. Yeah. We need to Plus 1,000 somewhere. So I know it's a lot of details and we're going to be tracking that. It's just, we got to make sure we know if you guys are really in so that we can provide you the information we need. And again, like we are going to love you where you're at. We're going to be grateful for what you can do, um, but we can't do this alone. So we're asking for help, which is one of the best lessons Ashley has ever learned in this business is to ask for help so that you guys know that you can ask your teams for help too earlier than later. Amen. That was the biggest, hardest lesson for me. Um, we don't expect you to do this alone. You don't have to have a single conversation with somebody alone. We're here to, to help you, you know, like when you have a toddler, you don't just stand them up and walk away. You're there to kind of help them get their wobbly legs under them for them to take their first steps. We're here to do the same thing and just kind of guide you in that direction. Cause we've already, you know, experienced the, the wrong things and the failures and the being salesy and feeling salesy and, and, you know, like the objections, chicken lists, you name it. We've gone through it between Christy and I, we have 10 years between the two of us in this business. So, um, we can't, I can't do this by myself. Team PCS can't hit a hundred club by itself. A hundred clubs, a hundred qualified businesses. Like we wouldn't, I wouldn't be here without you guys. So um, don't do your business without us. You know, like let's do this together and make it so much easier on everybody. <laughs> and asking for help is necessary and difficult, but necessary. Okay, Team Skates, NMD, this fall, Tampa, put it on your calendars, witness this, all this hard work that you're putting in. Come be at the front of the stage when Ashley gives this, this NMD speech. Okay? You guys are freaking amazing. Thank you for being on here. If you have any questions at all, let me know. But see my, my, my board right back there? I get to put all your names on it for the goals for Joan. I can't wait. I want to help you. If she, if she is not available, I want to be right there with you to make sure I can help you achieve your goal. Okay. All you gotta do is ask for help. Book us. All right. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Love you ladies. Bye. Bye everybody. Have a good night.